Hi, I'm Megan Matthews. And I'm Scott Matthews. So I was uh, born in the church, baptized in the church, confirmed in the church, and married in the church. Originally, I was raised Catholic. Um, and so when we um, moved back here to Richmond, it was kind of a no-brainer for us to, to join St. James's. We got, obviously being married here, I'm very fond of this place. Growing up, I, um, I did a lot of acolyting and Sunday school, vacation Bible school. Um, St. James's actually introduced me to St. George's camp in Shrinemont, uh, which I did for several years. Um, I, growing up, I really enjoyed watching my father usher, and my mom was very involved in food force, and I would help her with that. And um, she was also very active in the flower guild, and I would help her with that. So coming back to the church, you know, 20 years later, um, I'm able to do Flower Guild with my mom, which is really special. These are our girls, Harper and Virginia, and uh, we've been back in Richmond for four years now, and they've been having a lot of fun in the church. Um, Harper, the oldest one here, has started acolyting. Um, they opened the acolyte program up to the fifth graders this year, so she, um, she jumped right in and, and did a great job. Um, Virginia uh, loves to go to Sunny School here, loves all the programs. I think what motivates uh, Scott and myself to pledge every year is because um, we're, well, for me personally, I'm really interested in my children having the same upbringing in the church that I had and um, that they're able to do all the things that I got to do um, growing up and, and even now what I'm experiencing in the church. I realize that a, a church of this stature um, needs our support in a very big way. And so Scott and I really try to stretch ourselves every year to give as much as we possibly can. For me, it's just, you know, obviously you have a choice as to where you can spend your dollars and what you deem as something that charitable that you'd like to participate in. And for me, just seeing um, the amount of good work that's done through this place, I think makes it very easy to want to pledge and to donate. Aesthetically, St. James is by far the prettiest church we've belonged to in the past couple of years. It's not to say anything bad about the churches in Dallas or Atlanta, but it's just, um, it's, and then the music is incredible. I mean, obviously coming from a Catholic background, um, I, it's an incredible to me that the types of music that's played here, um, and also everybody singing and being a part of the community, I think is, is probably the biggest, I mean, it's the people that make this place, and I think that's the biggest thing that I've, I've noticed as something that's different than the other churches that we've been, been members of. Hi, I'm Megan. I'm not looking at the camera. All right. Dude, you nailed it.